Let me know you're ready for our comedy. Come on, three stars. It's a little late. Uh, next guy coming to the stage, very funny man. Makes his home in Los Angeles. Plays all the major clubs, comedy store, improv, laugh factory, colleges all over the country. Put your hand together for TJ Daniel. What's up, San Obispo? You guys doing? What is up with this mustache, dude? <laughs> is no one else comment on that shit? Is that real, brother? All that's up. That's all it's, it's up. all up. It's all up. Yeah. It's all looking up. What's up? I hear it, man. Are you in fraternity or something? That's what's going on? Yeah, just a man. You just know? a man, okay. <laughs> just a man, okay. I, I respect that. You're just a man. I'll calm down with you. Just a man. Just a man. I got a beard, let's go. We're, we're brothers. Yeah. Yeah. We're brothers. It's cool. Mine's thicker. Yeah, yeah, cool. a little bit, you know. I got grades, it's cool. We'll get there. We'll get there. Someday. Yeah, someday. You know, my name's TJ, you know, I like to talk about things I don't get in life. Sometimes I don't get mustaches. They're creepy. You can't be. You're a pedophile, maybe. I don't know. You're in the front row. You know, I, don't, I don't get that stuff sometimes. But, you know, you're a man. I'm a man. Man's gotta do what a man's gotta man's do. Man's gotta do what a man. Exactly right. But things I don't get when people ask me, well, how do you spell my name? I'm right, I said it. I'm like, are you serious? I'm like, T J. No, 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 really. Phonetically, how do you spell it? I'm like, T J. I'm like, what are you calling? I don't get that shit. Things I don't get at all. You know, my name. Things I don't get with uh, Asian ladies in here. Asian ladies are afraid of me. Anybody, any Asians here? It's okay. To... <laughs> Ning Lee, are you here? Suen, no? I mean, they're afraid of me. I mean, I have no idea why they are. I mean, I look like a celebrity, I'm a strapping Negro. Yeah? You see the hootie, you see the blowfish? Anybody see that? Yeah, come on. Asian girls are running away from me. I'm just, I don't know why, I don't get that. Asian girls live with me. Usually, they don't. They say Tyrone, they're like, forget that's my real name. They're like, oh. No, I'm kidding, no, it's good. Things I don't get. Things I don't get, getting fired from your job. Anybody been fired from your job lately? No? Yeah, okay. Why in the hell do they always use the two tap on the shoulder and you say, you got a minute? Because it never takes a fucking minute when you get fucking fired, right? Right? There's usually some weird lady from HR, you know, you haven't seen her since a Christmas party because you had sex with her cousin. Uh, you were there after the Christmas party to teach, you know, that would I have sex with an HR lady, it's cool. Or a cousin, doesn't matter. But things I don't get, it takes longer than two minutes to get fired from a job. And I'll only use my name in some term or term or play on words like, hey, teach, hey, big guy, grab me for a minute, you know, it's things I don't get. Things I don't get are my wife, you know? I, it, it happens all the time. I got another one for you. I was at work recently this week. We had, anybody know that we had the 20th anniversary of uh, the first World Trade Center uh, bombings? Did you hear about that? No one, it's, it's a very, you know, it's a known fact. 20 years ago, they did the first bombing. I got this. I gotta put this on my thing for a second. I got a bomb threat checklist at work on Tuesday. This is no bullshit. I'm gonna, I had to bring this in just to show you guys. I'm gonna show it to my man here. Contract checklist? No? Yes, sir. That's authentic. That's an authentic piece of paper I got. Things I don't get. War torn. Oh, and, and war torn, exactly. Because I'm nervous. I don't want to have a bomb threat. Who wants to be responsible for a bomb threat checklist at your work? Do you? Do you want to be responsible for it? I don't want one. No, who does? But listen to what they say. Things I don't get. It says, be calm and courteous when you get the call. Who the fuck's be calm and courteous on a bomb threat? Listen carefully and don't interrupt the bomber, okay? <laughs> Keep the caller talking as long as possible to collect information, okay? Now this is where it gets kind of crazy. Pretend difficulty hearing. What? what? <laughs> Why the fuck would I number 10 difficulty hearing is a bomb? They want to be intent listening on this guy telling me where the fucking bomb is. So I like to use a thing, he's like, try using this. Would you like to please repeat that to confuse him? You know, I'm like, that's not the way you want to deal with a bomber, you know? It's like, in, in, I use it like, I'm sorry, like, you know, ask me a question, just ask me anything. What's your favorite color? I'm sorry? Uh, <laughs> what's your favorite color? I, I'm sorry? Uh, you know, it's, I'm like an asshole at this point. He, this guy, you know, he, maybe he's the asshole when he's asking me a random no, question. Right. Exactly, asshole. but you're supposed to like pretend to trick this guy off, off by using trickery, by saying I'm sorry, difficulty hearing him. And then the other one is an alert and the others uh, alert others with prearranged signal during the call. So I made up some signal last week at lunch break doing this. <laughs> <laughs> Get out of the building, it's a bomb. <laughs> I know that shit, man. I'm black. 
Black people don't stay around for bombs, you know that. The first thing we hear is a bomb in the building, we're not even coming in. We get the tip off before the job comes on. No one's coming in. We're not jumping off the World Trade Center. Maybe you do. I don't know. I'm sensitive. I'm going to say that. Maybe you do. It's a fire. Man, you're going to jump off the building, right? What this is for. Exactly. You're Superman. Man. Things I don't get in my life. It's one of the bond threat, threat checklists I've talked about. This goes back in my pocket. Good Lord. So, got fired from my job. Not that long ago, but... I like to reminisce about those things and the bomb threat. Um, other things I don't get is like when my white girlfriend screams out in public. Says, please don't beat me! Are you serious when someone says, I cannot do that here. Right? Really? So you gonna pull off? Please don't beat me? I don't care if I didn't get you a beer last night, it's cool. You know, things I don't get in my life. Why would you do that to me? That's awesome. Things I don't get. Why do people come to ask me like, dude, you got an eight ball? What? <laughs> because I'm black, man? I don't sell drugs, I smoke them. From time to time, occasionally, man, you smoke weed, right? It's not, maybe not. Bas basalts. <laughs> Only when you're feeling hungry. Only when you're feeling hungry. Well, that makes more sense. Yeah. I don't know, I lost my train of thought there. <laughs> Things I don't get. This is what it all is. Things I don't get. Anybody else love Crown and Ginger? Anybody? Alcohol? Things I don't get. Why make the drink so fucking strong? I gotta drive home tonight, guys. <laughs> Things I don't fucking get in my life. Damn it. Anybody else ever waited tables before in here? Anybody got any waiters? There we go. Man's waited tables. This guy's waited tables. Speaking in the back, waited tables. Have you ever gone to the table and been that guy as a waiter and you haven't been there in two weeks and you've been off the sh you know, off the shift for medicinal purposes, medicine. Exactly. Yeah, you come in, you introduce yourself to the table, like, hey, I'm TJ, I'm here to serve you, what can I get you for the drink? And you get the, you get the low talker, things I don't get. Excuse me, man, it's really loud in here. I don't really need to hear what you're saying in front of me. down. Is that a chop salad? Man, I haven't been here in two weeks. I don't care you're getting the special. I don't give a fuck. <laughs> Speak up. I don't like low talkers and sex either. You know, if your girlfriend, not mine, you know, we'll talk about that later. <laughs> I can't hear, what? I don't get that. Speak up, tell me what you want me to do to you. I am black, it's cool. <laughs> you know, um, speaking of that, you know, being TJ has been a hard time for me. That's why, you know, I, 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 I like going by TJ instead of my real name, Tyrone. You know, because you think of Tyrone, you think of a scary black man in the alley, right? Yeah. <laughs> I'm scared. You should be. <laughs> Full beard versus just a single Manchu mustache. It's not going <laughs> Full beard. And gray, so I'm a, I'm a silverback. You know, <laughs> I will destroy you. <laughs> I'll end on this real quick. I'm having fun tonight. Um, I do like to have sex from time to time. You know, I do have a girlfriend, but we're going to talk about some things in the past. Um, sleeping next to me in bed lately, or before I met my girlfriend, was pretty, pretty intense. Was, I had lie a lot about sex and after sex. Not because of my penis size, but it's obvious what I got. Um, <laughs> it was more about... A problem I had, because uh, I would lose a girl after sex if I stayed over, because so next to me sleeping like to, you know, Raging Cougar in bed. Have you seen, you've heard of Raging Cougar? Mountain Lion, you've heard of that? It might snore, snores. It's okay, but it's an elite group. You can raise your hands in here. It's okay, this guy knows. Kind of sounds like this. Starts off real slow, a little slow. <laughs> Part of my sleep too. I'm awake, I'm awake. I sleep with my eyes open sometimes. Sometimes I felt like Billy Bob Thornton in my sleep from the sling blade. You hear that guy? 
Clubs around there, clubs and colleges around the country, and he loves the video games. Like I said, give it up. 